In this video, I'll navigate you to the process of setting up and utilizing the built-in auto-clicker feature on your iPhone. If you find this guide helpful, be sure to hit the subscribe button and give our video a thumbs up. Your support would motivate us to make ourselves better. Using an auto-clicker on an iPhone can automate repetitive tasks, saving time and effort. It's particularly useful for gaming, app testing, or any scenario where repeated tapping is necessary. Let's dive right in. Setting up the iPhone. Auto-clicker is pretty simple. First, launch your Settings app. Once inside, scroll down and locate the Accessibility option. Tap on it, then navigate to Switch Control. Now let's configure the switches. Tap on Switches, followed by Add New Switch. Opt for Screen, then Full Screen, ensuring you select Tap. With full screen tap set up, return to switch control, then head to recipes. Here's where the magic happens, building the recipe for our auto clicker. Tap on create new recipe, assign it a recognizable name, and select full screen as the switch. Now comes the fun part, choosing the action. While there are preset actions like tapping in the center or swiping, we're going custom. Select Custom Gesture, then tap on your screen to designate both the timing and location for the auto-clicker. For example, I'll tap down here to refresh the page and space it accordingly. If you want, you can tap up here for another action. Once satisfied, hit Save. With our recipe created, return to the Accessibility menu. For quick access to our auto-clicker, scroll to the bottom and tap on Accessibility Shortcut. Ensure switch control is selected. To activate the auto clicker from any screen, simply triple tap the power button, then choose switch control. Tap the screen and that's it. It executes the recipe, automatically refreshing the page. To deactivate, triple tap the power button once more. And there you have it. You've now learned to use the iPhone auto clicker. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to my channel for more handy tips and tricks. Also, I recommend checking out my website, MediaMagnetGuide.com. There, you'll discover a fleet of helpful tutorials and resources on a wide range of topics.